Good evening, or afternoon. This is Malkador, the level 26 bard. Let's just say level 27, because I'm going to gain a level real quick here. Um, playing on Project 1999 Red Server. I know just the spot to finish this level. It's a real easy pull involving four skeletons. So let's do this. So while I'm kiting the next group, I could be gaining percussion, brass instruments, and if I take any hits, defense. Let's look around for skeletons. Okay, so I do recall over here in the zone, that zone is, well, you know what? Let's pick up, whoa, did he just disappear? I must be dealing with some lag here. Did I pull him? Ah, yes, I pulled him. That's enough, whoa, camera. So that's enough to level right there, this guy. How about a warlord? How about both you guys? Now there's over here, there's gonna be on the other side. Wow, I didn't realize it was so far away. There's four skeletons, so we're gonna pull. Is there a guy coming after me? No. It was a running goblin. Oh, we do not want those things. Those things are annoying. So I'm in Lake of Ville Omen and I'm gonna be kiting. But before I get my next group, I wanna gain a level. Level 27. Whoa, I didn't know there was a thing in there. Professor Akabo, Aka. Akabeo. All right, Warlord's coming with uh, our good friend, the Lesser Charbone. I just don't want to leave him too far behind because if you do that, they can drop aggro. And because I'm using drums with Celo, I am like ultra fast. All right, here's the location I want. So what I'm gonna do, because I know that these guys like to social aggro. I'm gonna stand on the other side and let him run through that hut. Hopefully he'll pick up all his buddies. Okay, you can see him just to the left of that ruin. See if I can drag him right through the center of it. Come on, buddies. Ah, looks like we got them all. One, two, three, four. Maybe we got them all. Ah, there's one more. Did he not want to come? So they're all blue. Everything here is blue. All right, there we go. Forget about that thing. We don't want that thing. Okay. So if I could find a sweet spot over here to do it, you know, my circle thing, I run in circles, we'll gain this level. Okay, these Grimkins are on my nerves, man. So the music I have playing in the background is like some copyright free, influenced by John Carpenter. You may know John Carpenter. His name goes on the front of all his movies, like John Carpenter's Vampires. John Carpenter's The Thing. The Thing is a great movie. I also like John Carpenter's Vampires. I like John Carpenter's um, Prince of Darkness. And he does a lot of horror movies. The most famous horror movie is Halloween. And that came out before I was born. 
So it wasn't too long ago that I watched it for the first time ever. And I enjoy it. I like the atmosphere of it. And so my favorite Halloween film of the franchise is one of the least popular ones. And I think it was done by his wife. And it's called Halloween Season of the Witch or something like that. All right, how do I do this again? Oh yeah, we strafe, okay. It's been a while since I played. It's been a couple days, at least. I didn't even have a warm-up session here. All right, so let's do the circle thing. Um, what is this? I'll pull this guy in the group too. Bring your friends, okay. Yeah, I took a hit, but that's, a, that's fine, that's fine. And that guy I pulled is blue. So 97% of the way through the level. Okay, we got him. Look at them all, wincing in agony. Three resists on that. So I named this character after a fictional guy named Malkador the Sigilite, or he's Malkador is his name, but that's sort of how he's referred to. He is the regent of the Emperor of Mankind in the Warhammer 40,000 universe. At the end of the Horus Heresy, which happened in the Warhammer 30,000, I think, the Emperor was killed and so was Malkador. Malkador was a human who is also known as a perpetual. Perpetuals don't die. But they can be killed. It's kind of like a vampire, right? Vampires will live forever unless they get killed. So it's not easy to kill a perpetual. If they died of something like natural causes, I think they can return back to life. So it's kind of a weird situation. Whoa, what is this guy doing? Get out of here. I took a hit because um, some things are coming my way. We're gonna have to pull the group a little further away to a safe zone. So what I learned from kiting after the cu last couple episodes I made is don't get stressed out. This isn't a, this is a messy process of kiting. High risk, high rewards was what people say. That's so true. So when things don't go right, ain't no big deal. Expect bad things to happen, but the way I'm doing it, I'm recording it. So if I do some embarrassing mistakes, everybody's gonna see, and so that puts a little pressure. I do better when I'm not recording because I'm more focused, not so much on my brain thinking of what I want to say, but I'm focusing on what's happening in game completely. All right, we're getting close. One kill should get us this next level. This is a great place to pull. The last time I think I described it as a pretty bad place. It's great for this level range. I would say level 25 to maybe level 30-ish. I mean, they're gonna start turning green soon. Did I kill that? Oh, greater skeletons don't do any XP, so I did kill that one. And he died so much quicker than the rest because he's a weak, weak enemy. So Malkador is a human. Ding. Okay. He's the most powerful human in Warhammer 40,000. No, take that back. The Emperor's technically a human too. I guess you could say he's human. He sort of like transcended into godhood if you want to get technical. Ooh, there's another goblin over there. Is that the one I killed? I mean, is that the one I... I think that's the one I've been fighting. Yeah. Let's just finish him off like that. I'll run past him a few times and make him wince. Okay, probably a few more and he'll be dead. 
So this is the trouble when you have different mob types. They run away. Ah, damn tree. All right, we don't even need to worry too much. There's this guy right here. He ain't gonna, he ain't gonna kill us. So I'm level, I'm 15% of the way through this level already. And now I'm 18%. So I know I might be losing out on something. I don't know what those do. I don't want to even bother looking it up. I'm lazy. My bone chips. So that was pretty easy. So you, if you've never kited before, or the way I did it right there is a perfectly fine way to do it. It's working for me. A skeleton fist. Okay. I don't know what it's for. All right. So, I gain level. Let's put on this so I can work up my stringed instruments. Let's check and see. Nobody's in zone but myself. All right. Should I start gathering up a new group? Let me go to the bathroom. I'll come back and we'll just do that. Um, 27. I'm level 27. What could I do if I ran back? I could probably start killing Aviok, Avisets, but I want to gain one more level. One more level, then we'll run all the way back. Okay, well, I am back. I took a little break from the computer to do some things around the house. Okay. Now that we're level 27... I'm going to start grabbing, oh, we got him on our way, okay. I think I should be running a little quicker now. Now, I will ruin this. Ooh. Okay, so we got a green guy here. Let's see, a lesser ice bone. We'll get him. Okay. Cool, he missed me. I couldn't see what his, greater skeleton. Now, we don't want greater skeletons, but too bad I accidentally pulled him. Damn it. What is that thing? Ooh, we'll take a warlord. Hopefully we pulled him. Okay, we do not want those. Damn, there's goblins everywhere. Do not want those. Ah, do not want those. Whoa. <laughs> this is uh, dangerous. Okay. Soothsayer, no. Brawler, no. Too low. Soothsayer, hell no. Ice bone, yes. But he's only green, okay? So I'm going to turn off this run speed. Well, not yet. I'll leave it on. We ran right past me. He didn't even, like, tart. He didn't. Come on. Have to take all these hits just to get at your pull. There's a better way to do that than how I just did it. Okay, so I see a skeleton over there. I'm going to leave him. Now, don't do what I did last time and run super quickly and just leave everything behind me. All right. Ice bone. Yes. Spirit Collar. No, I don't want those. I think they probably are casters. But it looks like I'm dealing with lag because they disappeared. All right, we're dealing with lag. There he is. So I'll stop occasionally and let them catch up to me. Oh no! A soothsayer! Shoot! Crap. There goes my pull. It's over now. Okay, I'm still running even though I'm running blinded. 
Okay. So yeah, I can't deal with this. I have to, I have to run out. So because these things are everywhere, I mean, I could continue to do this, but eh, I don't know. Let's let's just explore the Lake of Ill Omen. Let's look for other places where there's less variety of mob types, so I don't have to deal with so much variety. Or we could try again. Let's try this one more time. Okay, let's see. Okay, we're starting over. We got two. Now I'm going to put on the Hymn of Restoration. Let it heal a few. What was that? Something... Oh, that thing is still after me. I forgot. I forgot they're all still after me. Of course, I didn't outrun them yet. What am I thinking? I thought they all just... It's like my memory... Short-term memory is gone. I forgot they were after me. Uh, what can we do? I really don't like pulling with all this stuff out here. Let's just let's just run past these things and look around. I'm going to run around this lake. If nothing is good, I'm going to run to the over there. We're gonna just keep going. Running for our life. Right, what do you have? Greater skill bone. Too weak. Ah, oh, what's over here? Okay, we got that. That sucks. That sucks. A flunky. A flunky, a skill bone. So this is like a lower level area. None of those would give me trouble. Oh shoot! Okay guys, he's got Spirit of Wolf on. Oh my god. Oh my god, I am bound way over there. No. No! Go, 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 go! Why am I running slow? Guys, I'm dead. Why the hell am I running slow? Hit number five. Oh my god, I'm still running. Seals is on tainted breath, disempower. Okay, run, run, run. Holy crap, I thought I was dead. I was staring at a black screen. Okay, so my life is dropping. Holy crap. Drums are on. Oh my goodness. And I was running super slow too, like when I, right before I went blind. Oh, I'm, a, I'm over encumbered, that's why. Shit. Right, we're destroying copper, I mean silver. I don't care. So that's what happened, he disempowered me and then it slowed me down because I was overweight. All right, I'm, I'm pretty safe now. Pretty safe. Yeah, I don't like kiting out here. Let's get the freak out of here. Oh. 
confusion, chaos. Okay. So I'm just going to run until I get out of their range, but I thought I was dead for sure. Thank goodness for this run speed. It's crazy fast. These stupid goblins, man. Oh, I'm back here? This looks familiar. Nah, it's a different area. Alright, let's turn around and see if I can find anybody after me. If not, I'm going to sit here and rest up and I'm going to read a wiki page to figure out where to go to get some safe, reliable pools. Is there anything after me? Yes, the Soothsayer is still after me. He's got Spirit of Wolf Speed on. Alright. He's still no match for how fast I can run. I have no idea where I'm at. So anyways guys, I'm going to run to a safe spot and then I'll see you in a second. You don't need to watch me run around. I'm just going to run out of his range and then I'm going to look up a wiki page and figure out where to go next because I don't want to deal with this. Okay guys, I decided I'm going to run over to... Um, what was the name of it? One second. I was going to run to... Fill the bone. Okay. So we are now... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Where am I at again? I'm at Lake of Ill Omen. Okay. I, I don't think I want to be here. So let me zone back out and run to the proper zone. I zoned in because these spiders got right up to the zone line and they chased me in here. But let's, let's, um, actually let me heal up first, just in case. I don't want to take any risks because I am bound way over in Kinos. All right, I might as well record this journey, uh, make the most of the limited amount of time I have to play today. I'm basically making, oh crap. Why is that thing there? That thing cons red to me. I can't stop running. I have to keep going. God. All right, let's see which direction I'm going. Do not stop. Sun's heading. I'm going to be going north. Oh my gosh, guys. Let's go north. I don't want to make the wrong turn because I have things chasing me that con red. All right, hopefully this is the zone. Uh, which way am I going? North. Jesus. Hope this isn't a wall. You can't tell if this is an invisible wall or not, but we should be getting close to one. But there's a zone line just north of here. Let me pull up the website while I'm running. Now this should be it. I'll do a quick turn around and look. All right, they're they're slow. So anyways, I do have things chasing after me. All right, so what zone is this again? Swamp of No Hope. Okay. So we need to go um I'm gonna follow the road to the let's see swamp of no hope we want to follow the road to the north pretty much right, we're going northwest which is fine All but we're gonna brush by East Cabalus. I'm gonna avoid Ixar guards. There's an invisible wall. Okay, I know exactly where we're at. 
it's going to open up and go straight north. Just to the right will be water. Okay. Should start going. There we go. And then just to the right of me will be water. And I should be heading north now. God, this is a place with poor visibility. There's the water. Okay. Don't stop running. We got a greater scale bone. We got morass leeches. Shouldn't attack me, they glower. Gotta watch out for Ixar. Okay. So let's make sure I'm going north direction. It says I'm going northwest. Still going northwest. There we go. This is north. Now, in about a minute, I should be coming up on East Cabalus. I have to be careful. Ixars would destroy me. And there's like Shadow Knight guards too that would harm touch. Yeah, let's eat that food. All right, still heading north. And get closer to the water. Okay. Ooh, there is Cabalus right there. Let's see what we got. Guard. Ready to attack. So I'm gonna have to run across here and I've got to fill the bone. Alright, let's do it. Ooh, there's another guard coming. Some frog locks, skippers. I wonder how hard it would be, or if it's even possible to get like good faction with those guys. A slave. A skipper. All right, I'm gonna follow the road. I gotta watch out for the knights. There's a knight. Con's green to me. Cool. At the end of this road that I'm on, I'm gonna hang a northeast direction. Perfect. I know exactly where we're at. Oh crap! That scared me. These things look vicious. All right, there's an XR camp. Let's um, take a look. Most of it's all green to me. Brigand, Marauder. Yeah, everything there is green. Cool. Did he even attack me? Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> cool. Ooh, blue. Wow, he attacked me. Cool. All right. Um, two. Three. Four. Two, one, oh, okay, I don't have the um, song set up the way I thought, okay, yeah, two, three, four, and five, yeah, 
it's been a while. And then five would be Hymn of Restoration. Okay. So, Brood of... What the hell? Something else is attacking me. I'll turn around and check it out in one second. Alright, let's see what's after me. Ooh, blue. Let's fight it. It's huge. Two, two, three, five, or whatever. Let's put a shield on. Two, damn, I'm like missing notes. Three, yeah, I'm gonna have to run. Why am I missing notes? Five. Let's just get out of here. Right, putting on the drum. Turn the silos on and run. Shoot. Go, 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 go. This is not the place to mess around. All right, so we want to go just a little. I think we got to go this way. And we're going to hang a right. Right here. Yes. Ooh. Now we're going to go this way. And then we're going to hang a left. <sighs> All right. Now we're going to hang another left. Okay. And there's a there's a ruins containing Shrethras just up ahead to the left, but we're not gonna go there. We are gonna zone into fill the bone. Here guys, fill the bone. I made it all the way across the world. Pretty exciting. Should I try to get the Ixar Berserker Club? That's the question. Possible, I could do it. There shouldn't be anybody down there camping. We're on red server. What I'll do is I'll take a look around. I'll go inside Kern's Tower. And I'll set myself up for the next episode at level 27. All right, let's see what we got. There is a no res person here named Only Hands. I used to suspect he's a monk playing with only his hands which is kind of a cool thing all right these guys are threatening but they are too low to they're too low for me so there's kern's tower let's make sure we don't run into any guards i'm just going to run through them and see what see what aggroes me Scorpions, bandits, marauders. What about that NPC up here? There's a guy up here. Where is he at? There he is. Indifferent. Okay. I've never really gone in that area. Bear and I, dubious. Let's go into Kerns. So let's look for a Scorched Tail Scorpion first. There's a chance that there is one in this area. So we're gonna target the Scorpions. Looking for a Scorched Tail. Sometimes, the one time that I seen it, it was in this area right here around this big fossil. 
Marauder, Large Scorpion, Scaly Tens, Greater Scale Bones, Excavators, everything's green. Everything here is green. Alright, nothing there. Let's get up this way. So I definitely need to start eating that food I loot because it's going to be a while before I can chop at a vendor. Heartstring Scorpion, Brigands, Charbones, I think those can give me experience. Heartstring, nothing. Nothing. I think this will give me a little XP. Not worth fighting. Skull bones. All right, let's go take a peek into Kern's Tower. Pretty neat that I made it all the way down here. Right, no one in here but me. Let's go down and check for that guy. Ah, come on, we got them all after us. Um, how do I want to handle this? Do I just want to fight my way there? They're everywhere. <laughs> oh, great. Got them all after me. Um, can I just do this? Can I just do this? Get them all? Let's see how fast they die. Yeah, they're dying quick. Yeah, I'll just do this to get rid of all. They're not really doing much damage to me. Okay, so I want to do four and three. There we go. I'm going to switch to my guitar and I could do five and four. Yeah. So five, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, one, two, three. We need to do three. So three is him of restoration. What is three? three? Oh, three is Denon's. So we need to do um, chords. So we need to do four. And where's my hymn of restoration at? God, ah, this is uh, not the way I wanted it. We can do three and four here. Chords of dissonance. There we go. And hymn of restoration. That's the two I'm going to twist for now. Sorry, it took a while to get it organized. All right, let's kill these guys. I think it's just quickest to do it this way. I'm gonna work on healing myself up while I do this. So I'm twisting chords of dissonance and Time of restoration.
thought this would go quicker. Alright, let's do this one. So we're going to do the number two dot. This one's Denon's Disruptive Discord. Yeah, this one does a lot more damage. And we'll do that and we'll twist heal. Yeah, this one's really strong. Six AC, two decks, and two charisma. Holy crap, that's pretty good. That might even be better than my Panils. Two decks and two charisma? I mean, I'm dropping a lot of AC, but I'm getting four stats, and dexterity is super important in charisma as well. Let's actually take a look at it and see how it looks. Oh man, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna hang on to it. And Okay, we're getting overweight again. Destroy Bronze Dagger. Man, okay. That's freaking good. Alright. So these guys will not... You know what I can do? No, I can't because um, Undead sees through the invisibility. But when I'm worried about these guys, I might be able to just run past them with my song on in case I, I ruin my faction with them I can just play a song and bypass them all the other option would be to fight my way out but I don't think I'll need to okay so this area is kind of looking familiar okay some stairs Whew, scares me Oh, looky there. Thick bone skeleton. I think she's the ones that, that hurt your faction, too. Let's look for the jester. Or oh, there's a cook in here. Skeleton. All right, let's take a look here. Thick boned. That's the placeholder for the jester. Now, if you turn this corner, there's going to be a cook in one of these rooms. I didn't see him. Shoot. Hold on. Mouse came off. Freaking A, man. What's going on? All right. He's... Nothing. 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 Okay. There's usually guys in here. All right. All right, let's do it. Let me get my heel song going. Put on my cold aim weapon. Right, I'm trying to figure out what other things that is weighing me down that I don't need. Anyways, let's kill this guy. Oh wait, we gotta use 12, yeah. Here we go. So I'll probably log out here and keep logging back in to see if the next guy came. So I'll, what I'm going to do is I'm going to log back in when this placeholder respawns. Let me find Kern's Tower up here so I can um, know how long I need to... So it's an 18-minute 18, 18 
respawn here. It's quite a bit of time. And it's going to hurt my burn eye faction. Oh, wait. Ooh, turn off uh, the dot spell when they run by. What do we get? Fine steel, Warhammer. Uh, let's loot this. Damn, we're getting overweight. Let's make sure my faction is okay. So I'm gonna set a timer on my on my phone now. Hey Siri, set my alarm. Hey Siri, set a timer for 18 minutes. 18 minutes, counting down. All right, guys, I'm going to check this in a little bit. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Uh, a little bit of a chaotic episode. Hopefully we can get an XR Berserker Club soon. See you soon. Bye.